This is CBS. Among the top stories tonight, U.S. Transportation Secretary Elizabeth Dole is in town tonight. We'll have a report. The city begins work on revamping local taxi laws. And there is one more fallout from last week's cruise ship hijacking. We'll have the latest on these and other stories coming up next on Nightbeat. News 15, working harder for you. Good evening, I'm Liz Berry. And I'm Ken Owen. The number one woman in the Reagan administration is in Fort Wayne tonight. Transportation Secretary Elizabeth Dole is in the city for a Republican fundraiser, and she took time out to talk about the issues facing her department. Secretary Dole's plane landed at Bear Field at about 4.45 this afternoon. At a news conference at the airport, Dole said her department is busy analyzing results of a study on the 55 mile per hour speed limit. The study was compiled by the National Academy of Sciences. Uh, what they came up with is that very definitely 55 mile an hour produces safety <coughs> benefits. Uh, the panel split on a recommendation that on rural interstates there might be a uh, an opportunity to raise the speed limit if the state has a seatbelt law. Mrs. Dole says her department is still studying the data, so trying sure to determine the if the speed limit should be increased. Systems. But uppermost on the secretary's mind is air safety. More than 1,400 people have been killed in air disasters worldwide this year. Despite the problems, Dole says air travelers really have little to fear. I want to reassure the American people that uh, as we have about 14,000 flights a day in the United States, and that involves about a million people traveling every day, 99.999% of those flights are without incident. Secretary Dole says because the airline industry is growing so fast, she plans to add about 1,000 air traffic controllers and 500 safety inspectors over the next three years. She also says the U.S. is taking steps to beef up security at foreign airports in hopes of preventing future hijackings. Tonight, Mrs. Dole capped off her day in Fort Wayne here at the Grand Wayne Center. She was the featured speaker at a fundraiser for Congressman Dan Coates. In her speech tonight, Secretary Dole said the recent government sale of Conrail to Norfolk and Southern will result in a stronger railroad, and that's good news for Fort Wayne. The Norfolk Southern sale will bring Fort Wayne shippers head-to-head -head single line competition into the Northeast for the first time since the Pennsylvania merged with the New York Central in the late 60s. The bottom line, by giving Fort Wayne shippers a stronger Conrail, it gives you the best possible protection for your future shipping needs. Secretary Dole, who's been frequently mentioned as a possible candidate for president in 1988, calls Dan Coates a friend of transportation, a man who's fighting for the interests of Fort Wayne and the nation. <laughs> 